let's unbox these battery operated wall sconces. What I want to see is if they look natural and high quality and if they'll work well for my daughter's bunk bed. When you open it up, this is what you get. And there are actually three different ways to install these on your wall. The first one is using these magnetic circles that have command tape on the bottom. You'll just stick this on the wall and then this will go directly onto it. It just connects just like a magnet, just like that. And so that is if you really know exactly where you want it and you don't want it to have as much control as it will with the ball. The other two ways are with this ball socket. You'll put it together. It feels really good. This wood is really nice. I'll show you close up in a moment, but you just twist it together. And this is all super sturdy. It has a little weight to it. It's a little top heavy. So it definitely needs either a strong sticker to install it, or it comes with the screws and drywall anchors. So you can anchor this to the wall. And then with the ball, you'll just hook the light right onto it. It hooks on really nicely. And then you can still spin it around just like the plain magnet, but you can also move it on the ball to aim it where you want it to be. Now the magnet on the back of this is really nice. It's kind of a rounded spot, perfect for that ball bearing. And it has a USB-C outlet on the back to charge it. And it comes with two USB-C to USB-A charging cords. Now let's get to the light itself. It feels really nice and it looks really nice. It's very streamlined, really good quality. All the edges are really nicely done. It looks like real wood. Now to turn it on, you simply tap. It's really easy and it's really obvious. There's an etched in on off little image on the top. It's really clean. And it, as you can tell, is super sensitive. I don't even have to tap it very hard for it to turn on and off. And then you can control the dimness. Right now it is at very low bright level and it will stay like that, which I love because I plan to have these as bedside lights and I want it to always be dim. I don't want to have to turn it on and have it start at super bright. But if you do prefer super bright and you want it to stay at that level, you just hold down the on off button and it will get really, really quite bright. And then it will stay at that. So if I turn it off and turn it back on, it'll stay at that brightness level. Really clean on the back. There's your light for charging. I love the attention to detail on the corners. Everything about it is really smooth, really clean. And then you have your on off button right here, really clear to see that. And it is truly as easy as just clipping it on and off. And the light itself is also really nice. Thanks to this more opaque plastic here, it gives a little more diffuse light, even though it's very focused. Really, really nice.